I, I feel excited every morning. It's awesome. Is the I see this stage of uh, of science and development of technology is also changing the way we're gonna treat patients in the next years. There are different kinds of liver failure, but the one that I'm interested on is end stage liver disease, which is the development of cirrhosis or fibrosis in those livers, and then um, and then failing. The only really curative uh, alternative for this is liver transplantation, but it's very limited the amount of livers that we have available to uh, treat all these patients. It's a huge problem. So we are developing one of a kind technology that we believe can transform transplantation once more. We call it transcriptional therapy. Basically what we have been doing in the last 10 years is understanding the process that those cells in those livers go through from being healthy to being failing and being diseased. Now we have proven uh, with the same technology that people have developed vaccines for COVID-19 based on mRNA. I think development of technologies in the area of personalized medicine will really make clinical trials and development of new drugs more effective. The, the change that a, a, a patient will see will be dramatic, you know. Uh, you will not have to go through the immunosuppression lifelong. You don't have to go through surgery. So it will change their lives completely. There is a lot of people that don't get transplanted and that have other coadjuvant diseases like heart disease and they really don't have any option. Since we believe that this concept can be adapted to other organs, we will start looking uh, into what the genome says in human kidneys, human hearts, and human lungs. Those are the people we can help right away.